Hello everybody, Santa Claus here. Still in Batangas. Hopefully not too much longer. Still waiting on those shots. Anyway, uh, not a whole lot going on today. Just a quick video to uh, keep you updated. Um, Grace and uh, Mommy. I mean, uh, Catherine and Mommy. <laughs> Catherine, Grace and Grace. Uh, they went to a birthday party. Uh, she's been showing me some pictures of Catherine swimming and the kids all having fun. I guess they went to some resort close by here. I'm not really sure. Uh, but, of course, I didn't go. I stayed home and made spaghetti and meatballs. Actually, after I get done this video, I'm going to go eat some more. <laughs> came out pretty good uh, but uh, yeah I just I, I'm not I'm not big on these birthday parties and stuff and I don't I don't even know how they're really allowing it to be honest with you uh, kids can't go to school but they can go uh, to a birthday party and go swimming I don't know doesn't make any sense to me but maybe it's uh, how many people are there I'm not sure but I'm glad she's there anyway. Glad she's having fun. She needs to get out and she needs to be around other kids. So it's good for her. And when she comes home, she's worn out. She's tuckered. And she goes to bed pretty much right away. And they all bring food and drinks and everything. They have, they have a good time. Uh, so uh, other than making spaghetti and meatballs, I didn't do a whole lot today. Except for cleaning my truck, I washed it and uh, put a little bit of wax on certain areas that didn't come out real good last time I waxed it. Uh, cleaned the wheels and tires real good. Um, we might be making a trip tomorrow to Alabang. At least uh, the wife is anyway. I'm not sure if I'm going yet. Um, because Catherine again is the issue she can't go along um, so we have to find somebody to watch her if I want to go also but uh, what we're planning on doing is we're trying to still get the new globe at a home box the new version the latest version uh, like we like I explained in a previous video with the problems we had here and to now on. So we talked to Adam when he was here about the issue since it's uh, under his address in Quezon City. And he called Globe from his phone and explained the situation. And they said, oh, uh, well, you have to go to a bigger Globe outlet and see what they say. So they made an appointment to go to uh, Alabang uh, so she's going to bring the old box tomorrow and see if they will upgrade us on a new box tomorrow. So I'd like to go with her because I don't like her handling all that kind of stuff by herself. She doesn't really know everything to say. And it's better that both of us be there. But, uh, you know, if we can't find somebody to watch Catherine, then um, I have to stay home. So I'll let you know one way or the other. If we uh, do go there, I'll try to make a little video. Probably won't be able to record while, while we're talking the globe. I doubt. I doubt whether I'll be able to record that. But uh, I don't know. We'll see what happens. Uh, but the good news is I did get my paperwork and my little uh, card from the brand guy here saying that I'm senior uh, so that I can get the uh, vaccination when it's available uh, by senior um, priority. So I did get that. I got a laminated card and a letter. So that's good. And it's good to have anyway, uh, just to say Brian Guy knows who I am. 
and then I've been here for a while, and that they they're well aware of all the situations here. So uh, that's a good thing. Um, and then uh, Tuesday, the new owners are having like uh, a surveyor come and um, lay out their exact property lines. They want to know what it is. They did go to City Hall and get a layout. And they found out some stuff we didn't even know. Like the right of way here is uh, just temporary. It's not the uh, right of way listed by the City Hall. And um, the uh, town in Tatas here, it's not, it's not correct. The right of way, the actual right of way is supposed to be over by her sister's property over there. So, uh, so yeah, we didn't even know that. But, um, oh, well, it's not our problem anymore anyway. <laughs> they did ask if I wanted to sell my lawnmower. <laughs> and I really don't because I need it for the beach. Because uh, uh, they know they got a lot of grass to cut now. <laughs> And they're going to have to do it. Somebody's going to have to do it. Because it grows fast. If they don't keep up on it, it's going to be a jungle. So I said, I told uh, my wife to tell them, you know, they can buy they can buy one through Lazada. Or they can just get the uh, weed whackers like everybody else uses here in the Philippines. Uh, just get one of those. They can find those at the hardware store. Anyway... I, I told them I really need to keep mine. Plus, it's 110 volts anyway. It's not 220. We use a, a transformer to charge the battery. Um, that's about it, really. That's all I can really update you on until I know if we're going tomorrow or not. The puppies went to the vet today for their uh, checkup again, and I think they had a round of shots. I don't know. cost me close to 2,000 pesos. Another 40 bucks, 35, 40 bucks down. And I guess they got an appointment in another two, three weeks. So if we're still here, we'll, we'll let them go. That's, uh, she said that's their last one, their last appointment. I said, if we're still here, we'll go. If we're not still here, too bad. Um, but yeah, that's it. That's really, uh, so we've been keeping fairly busy, or at least she has anyway. I haven't been that busy. Like I said, just working on my truck. And um, going to go in the house, eat some more of my spaghetti and meatballs. I already took a shower, so I'm going to nice relax now until they get home from their adventure. So uh, stay tuned. Make sure you like and subscribe. And uh, see what happens tomorrow, whether I get to go to uh, Alabang or not. I will keep you posted. Thanks for watching. God bless everyone. Santa Claus now living in the Philippines. Over and out. Ooh, nice thunder. Take care. Over and out.